I wish I knew what's going to happen when I get this piece back in place. Where have you been? Where have we been? I need your crystals. All of them. Right now! Come on, Brink. How many crystals can one man use? Not for me, you fools. I need them for my machine. For science. Research! Give them to me! Machine? What are you talking about? I'm through talking! I'm not going to let anybody stand between me and the greatest scientific achievement in history! I only have these few crystals left, Brink, but I'll be glad to share some of them if you want. All of them! You didn't share anything, Lo. I took them! And it's a good thing you didn't fight me. I would have killed you to get these. You would have tried. You two will be nothing but a footnote in the annals of my achievements. He didn't damage the machine part, did he? It fits. But the machine still doesn't work. Did the alien lie to us? Or does the machine need something else? Looks like a life crystal would fit perfectly in here. Looks like a life crystal would fit perfectly in here. I guess I'll take this with me.
Get away from here! I won't let you break my life crystal machine! We don't want to break anything. My machine isn't working yet. Yes, gloat if you want to. I've studied all the inscriptions. Maggie's not the only one who can decipher strange languages. I followed the plans I found, but there's still something missing. And without it, the machine won't work. So if you think you can steal my life crystals again, Commander Lowe, think again. I'll kill you first, and believe me, no one will ever revive you. Actually, you robbed me twice, and I only robbed you once. So you're still one ahead. Don't joke with me! Don't joke with him, Boston. Go away! My work is very important. You can't possibly understand what I'm doing here. Get the hell out of here! Just leave me alone! I don't want that. It's just another artifact. Brank, this is important. I think I know what piece is missing from your machine. How can you know anything about this? You're not a scientist. You're just a strutting tin soldier. I think it's the same piece that the eye generator needed. I think it's the key to all this technology. The alien inventor hid it because without it, None of the machines he considers dangerous will work. Why would the creator of life crystals think they were dangerous? Because the crystals make you feel so good that they take over your life. All you care about is getting more of them. He said it was the second worst mistake he'd made. And the worst mistake? The eye. So you and Maggie, you keep telling me I'm crazy. <laughs> but you plan to make an even worse mistake. I'll make you a deal, Brink. Yes, like the deal you made before. I keep my part, but you go back on it. I didn't go back on it, I just wanted to talk about it with you first. No deals with liars and thieves. Brink, you need what I have to make your machine work. But if it works, then you'll have plenty of life crystals, right? You could share them with us and it wouldn't cost you anything, right? If you have the missing parts, yes. That's my deal. Your machine, my part. 50-50 on the life crystals. I know you plan to cheat me. We won't even come near the machine when it's running. You divide up the life crystals. Then what's to stop me from keeping them all? Because I am trained as a military man, Brink. And if I ever actually decide to fight you, I don't care how strong and healthy you are. You will lose. And then I will take them all. Got it? Get your missing part and put it in my machine. Even liars and thieves can bargain as long as they watch each other very carefully. I just don't know how yet to link them up. It fits perfectly. This is how the aliens designed the life crystal machine to work. Nothing's happening. Yes, it is. It's vibrating. Be patient. Who knows how fast it's supposed to work? We'll just have to wait. Suits me fine. We'll split them 50-50, right? Of course. Yeah. 
50-50. Look, there's one. And another. Two. Is that all? Just two? I need more than two. I don't know about that, Brink, but it's a sure thing I need more than one. You still have all the crystals you stole from me and every other place on these islands. Don't touch them! 50-50, you said, Brink. Well, you must have hundreds of life crystals. It's not even 50-50 if I take these two. I knew you were a liar and a cheat. You weren't gonna let me have even one of these. I'll make the machine even better. It will produce more. Not till we're gone, it won't. I need that machine part to run the eye generator. You will take nothing from this machine, you lying thief! Once the eye is working, you can either come back with us to Earth, or you can stay here, take the part out of the eye generator, and put it back in your own machine. Just have a little patience. No! My machine is stopping! You've wrecked my machine! You're a dead man! Brink, please. We don't have to fight. You can have the part back after we're done with it. Everything you say is a lie! Maggie, tell him. If you say a word, Maggie, I'll kill you too! Brink. Don't make me hurt you. You won't hurt me when you're dead! Frank! Ah! Ah! Oh, Maggie, please believe me. I didn't want to hurt him. I didn't want him dead. It wasn't Brink who died here. Brink died when he fell down the hole when we first arrived. What just fell over the cliff was someone else. Someone alien. Created by those death crystals. Maggie, are we making an even worse mistake? By activating the eye? Staying in this world any longer than we have to, that's the worst mistake we could make. We've got to do anything we can to survive. But what if we die trying? Don't you get it, Boston? This place is worse than death. I'd rather die than stay here. Robbins. You were starting to tell me something before Bob the Lobster came to pick you up for your date. Just a sample of what I was reading. Nothing significant. What mattered is that I could understand it. I've caught on to how their language works. I don't know about you, but I'm starting to get tired. I've done a lot of digging. And I've done so much reading, my eyes ache. Poor Brank. Dying one miserable death wasn't good enough. Whatever died the second time, 
it wasn't Brink. It was the evil of the crystals manifested in Brink's body. If they can make bridges out of light, you have to wonder if they can make anything else. You mean, light beer? I was thinking more of a lighthouse. Light-minded. Light-hearted. Light-footed. Light-hearted. Light-footed. Light-hearted. We've got to try and turn on the inventor's machine. It's the only way to find out what it does. Well, we've got the part. Do you have any idea what it was you did to attract the thing to you? I don't wear perfume, and heaven knows this outfit isn't exactly alluring. I was just sitting there. Apparently that's enough. That's usually enough for very lonely men on Earth. As for this monster, I'd just as soon not have another date like that anytime soon. I'll bet he could give information about lots of topics. After seeing what they've done to Brink, we'd better think long and hard before we start duplicating these back on Earth. Don't worry. We're probably never going back there. And even if we do, I doubt anyone will ever be able to figure out this alien science. I feel like I'm just what he called me. A traitor. A liar. You were dealing with a madman. You were trying to save him, too. Do you think we should try this part in the eye? It's probably our only chance of getting home. Thanks. <laughs>